Hey you guys, it is your girl Kia of y'all up in the building. I love all your screen. And guess what, y'all? <gasps> Look what came in the mail today. 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 Look, 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 hey. look, hey. <laughs> Hey, you guys, as you already know, it's your girl, Kiva, up in the building, all up on the screen, and we have an unboxing from that girl, Zara. Now, Zara, y'all know better. Why y'all got y'all logo and stuff all plastic over the dang on box? Listen, you wanted to get stolen. That's what you wanted. So, you guys, I have this package from Zara. I love them for their accessories and their shoes. Not so much their clothing. I have never tried their clothing though. So I don't know if I can fit it or not, but listen, I'm thinking, I ain't trying to, I'm not trying to figure that out yet. So if you guys watched my Zara video from a long, long time ago, many, many videos ago, then you would have seen me talk about these shoes or the sisters of these shoes that are high heels. Yeah, they had these low dress shoes that have been on my radar for months okay i've been watching this shoe for months okay and now it's been like going in and out of stock so i was like girl stop playing get your size and be done with it you know and be done with it so let me open this box so it is a pair of dress shoes it is a pair of flats based off of the what is it probably the cover of this uh video y'all probably already know what it is but child listen I ain't seen them in the flesh yet. So, yeah. I'm going to open this up box. Let's see what we got. All right. This box is so big. All right. So, this is how it comes. <laughs> they are just in there. Oh, I was wondering if I would get a shoe box or not. And I do. Or they do. I didn't mean to hit y'all. I'm sorry. I'm smacking the camera all in the face. I'm sorry. You okay? You, you all right? I'm sorry, sis. So this is the box. Zara. I think that their box is just so classy and clean. Like, it looks rich without doing too much. And I like that. I, I don't mind it at all. So this is the box. And hey, you how do I open this box? Is a question. I'm excited about it. So I did go true to size. These are called the Ballerina Crystal Shoes. This is how it looks. I went to my true to size size nine and women's, so hopefully it works out. If not, I'm gonna be mad. But yeah. How you open this? Oh. Yeah, what is that? It, it opened at the side. You gotta do the little wings so it can fly before you can get to your stuff. The work. The work. Alright, so it comes in this little black wrapping paper. And then, y'all, I gotta type, okay? <laughs> I, I gotta type. <gasps> Look at this. Look at it twinkling in the box. <laughs> I'm happy. I love a little show to move. I'm an old person. I got both. Oh my goodness. Y'all. They're so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Look at these, y'all. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's everything I imagined and more. You guys, I absolutely love them. Now, y'all know I've been on a dress shoe kick lately because I went from zero dress shoes to now I have probably like I wouldn't even say 10 pairs yet. I'm 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, doo -doo -doo. <laughs> I have like five pairs over there, including these now of dress shoes. Well, I'm lying. There's two more over there. Seven. We're going to round it up and say eight, okay? I got eight. So these are new. I have nothing like them, but I, I kind of do. Listen, do I have a type or not? Because a couple weeks ago... We was talking about these. And now this week, we talk about these. These kind of shimmer a little more. These doing something a little weird. I don't know. They both glittering. Ah, oh, I just love them. <laughs> I just love them so much. Oh, my goodness. They are so, like, well made. 
So it's these like rhinestones on top of another like new book velvet type of deal. Look how it's just glistening. You guys. I'm glad I got them. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Oh my goodness. I am so happy that I got them. I have been staring at these for months contemplating like, am I going to get them? Are you going to pass? Like, what are you going to do? You know you want them. And I have just been going back and forth with myself like, no, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. And I waited. And here they are. And I think they still sold out of my size now. Because as soon as I bought them, like, they sold out for a while. And they kind of been out of stock, like, legitly now. So, you here are the backs of them. The rhinestones look very well organized on these. Okay? Y'all see my other ones? They was rocky and they was all over the place. These look like they have a little bit of strategy to them. They, they were strategic with the placement of the rhinestones of these guys. Oh, these are so cute. I know somebody gonna be like, this old woman, little church lady shoes. Absolutely, why not? They twinkling, they beautiful. They look so chic to me. They look very classic to me. And I absolutely love that for me. But the bottoms, of course, all the bottoms are always so slick. They just want me to break my neck and knee, and knee whiplash and all that other stuff going on in these. But... I don't care because this is cute. Let me put it on my foot. Y'all, I'm not going to lift up my foot this time because y'all already be knowing I will be over here doing aerobics to show y'all how a shoe look. I'm going to figure that out in the future. But these are just so sneaking cute. <gasps> I feel like Cinderella. They fit. <laughs> they fit. Now, are these your cockroach in the corner pointed shoes? Absolutely. But I absolutely love them for me. All right? I absolutely love them for me. <sighs> get them is what I would say. If you like stuff like this, I would tell you to get them now because they are selling out in the sizes, the big sizes. I know that they still had a lot of the small sizes. But as you get past like 9 and go down 10, 11, 12, listen, they starting to run out of stock. But like I said, they did come back in stock. So I don't know if they'll keep playing that game back and forth. Zara's tends to do that. They they tend to do that a lot. And then they'll eventually like sell out. And then you'd be like, dang, I thought you was going to restock one more time for the one time. And they don't. So <laughs> when you start seeing them playing them games, go ahead and grab your pair. Because listen, it's absolutely worth it. These are so beautifully made. Like, it doesn't feel cheap at all. The rhinestones feel secure. It's not sticky. Like, it's not just wrapped up in, like, the, what is it? The crystal little stick-ons. Like, these are good. And I love the heel. The heel that's very non-existent. I feel like mama gonna ask to borrow these. Low-key, high-key. Am I gonna let her? Maybe. Maybe when she wanna be the bling queen. I'd be like, hey, mom, go ahead. You need to wear these because the heel is perfect for her. All right. She ain't going to be hurting no arch and nothing else like that. So, yeah, these are my shoes. This is the Zara shoe unboxing. What do you think? Do you like them? Do you have a pair? Do you think they're ugly? If you think they're ugly, I understand. Different strokes for different folks all the time. Uh, but listen, it looks like I got a type. Anything that shines. <laughs> Anything that shines. Shimmers and glitters is your gal. All right. Listen, I have a lot of black shoes now. A lot of black and silver. I need some gold. I need some more color. Listen, let me stop. Let me stop. I think I need to chill out. <sighs> Maybe. We think about it. I got one more shoe to show y'all later on too. So listen, this is the video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like content like this, definitely like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know, I will see you later. Bye.